everybody. Welcome back to another video. Alright, as you can see, we got Captain America Sharon Rogers with her newest uniform, the Poseidon Armor. Alright, as you can see, I have her potential. Got it in one shot. So, that was perfect. Alright, so, we're going to get to the uniform. Uh, got it mythic. And with this uniform, you get it at $8.75, so it's 50% off right now. So, if you want to get it, it's cool. She's free to play. All right, with the uniform effect, it enhances basic stats. And then she still has the uh, chain hit damage by 25% and decreased basic damage received by 40%. So that makes her a little bit more tankier. So that was a flaw with this uniform. As you can see, they bumped it up by 30%. All right, and then the uniform options are, they're all outdated now. So... But you still want the uniforms to try to get the extra stats for the uniform for your characters. But they're all kind of bad uh, options. So you have Spider-Man, black and gold suit. You have uh, Hawkeye, Kate Bishop. You have Dormammu, Drax, classic. And we're going to get Guardians of the Galaxy 3 probably in the next two or three weeks or so for the anniversary. So just be on the lookout for that. And then we have Blue Dragon, Moon Temple Defenders, which is a Crystal Wall character. Alright, so now, with Sharon Rogers. Alright, her gears. I have what that, four, six, seven Odin Blessings on her. The rest of them are like Mythic and Legendary uh, Energy Attack Uru. All her skills are at level six now. <clears throat> Her two-star pat, well, her tier two passive, uh, guaranteed crit rate by 15%, ignore dodge rate by 35%, and skill damage bonus damage. So, she has a chain hit, and she has guaranteed crit rate. So you could either use an energy or a rage. So, all right, and then her four-star passive gives her 20% ignore defense and super armor. And a uh, basic defense by 30%. And her leadership, as you can see, is still the same. All right, so her one skill has stun. Her second skill has a B pad, so we're going to get into that in a minute. Uh, it has paralysis. Her third skill has burn and silence. And she has a 15% uh, increase to all basic attack per 1% of pure damage received. So she has to take damage. As always, to give damage. Alright. Uh, her fourth skill. On the third skill has burning silence. Fourth skill has silence and incapacitation. With invincible for five seconds. And she has a, a damage proc for 60% for one attack. And then her fifth skill has burn, snare, fracture. All defense down. And, uh, and crit rate increased by 35%. And she has a 35% heal for one second. So... That's pretty cool. And her tier 3 is still the same. Alright, so. And her type is a rank 5. And she has a stage 12 Power Ranger Hulk. And she does have her artifact, which you can get for free from the uh, Dimension Rifts. Uh, doesn't have the right instinct, but that's okay. But it does have decreased damage received from boss types by 7%. And her passive is just a instant crit rate and crit damage. And the custom gear haven't changed it. She has a mighty CTP with the beatdown proc, uh, 200%. All right, so the skills. We'll get into the skills real quick. All right, so pretty dope. She still has a little bubble shield on her. So the first skill. You can see she turns into like a little gun or whatever. Second skill, the V pad. That's pretty dope. Moves around. Third skill. As you can see, wow. Okay. That's pretty cool. A little orb shoots out and just pulls you back. The fourth skill. Has the same. She does two slashes, then she does the beam. And then her fifth skill. She throws a spear in the air and a giant spear comes out. That is dope. I just want to turn that on. Cut that off. Alright, so. Alright, we're going to check out that fist skill one more time. Wow, that, that, that's, that's dope. 
That's awesome. All right, and then her tier three is basically the same where she charges up and then she just lets it rip. I like the color schemes on it, it's pretty dope. So, her combo is pretty much the same. You're gonna do three, cancel five, delay into the four. That way, you can get all the hits. And then, like for the tier three, you're gonna do three, five, delay, four, six. And if you want to, you can splash into two just for a little bit of damage. So, but yeah, they always have to practice combo just in case. You know, you got three, five, and then four. And you can see that. So, and then same with the tier three. And then your tier four, they're saying do seven, three, five, four, six. You know, I messed up. But, uh, yeah, it's pretty pretty cool. So, we're going to take it into some content real quick. As you can see, I have her at level 70. Have not touched her yet. Level 70. Potential unlocked, but I'm going to wait. I'm going to take her into some content, and then we're going to get her to level 80. So, with her stats, as you can see, she has 57,850 energy attack. Defense is about the same. 16,009, 16,008. And her HP is at 58,000. All right, and all her uh, main stats are uh, capped out. Her crit rate, crit damage, ignore defense, dodge, and cooldown. And she has 127.95 on attack speed. And she does have her leadership, so she can take advantage of the White Fox Kamiho stance buff. And also, she has energy projection, so that way you can take her into uh, Ultron, which we're probably going to do in a minute. <clears throat> so give them one sec to make a team and we'll be right back. Alright, so we're going to try stage 39 of Ultron where you need energy projection. So with these, uh, these two stages I was using Iron Man and then for the last one I was using Black Bolt. So now we're going to try with Sharon Rogers. We're going to use Cyclops as lead and support. And Sharon, I mean, uh, Captain Marvel's. Uh, I think she has a, a support also. One second, let's check. I know she has a leadership, but I think she has a support also. Nope. No, she doesn't. But she does have a team up. With Sharon Rogers, I think. So, anyway, we're going to get into this real quick. Stage 39 of Ultron. We're going to see how she does. So, um, the uniform looks gorgeous. I like how the aesthetic looks. Pretty dope, so. All right. Two, three, five, number four. to a pretty rough start right now but like I said she's level 70 right now <clears throat> so maybe once I get her level 80 maybe she'll do a little bit better so I at least want to test her out
Okay. Three minutes. She only got down to 24 bars, so. All right. It's not good at all. Not good, so. All right, we're going to go ahead and do this. Let's see. Should I do it on another world boss? Maybe not. All right, so what we're going to do, we're going to go ahead and just take her to level 80. And then we're going to see how far she can go right now. So, all right. Indomitable will. All right. So, going back to the tier three materials. 100% method. Now with the bios, you can get her bios for free. From Shadowland. You can get the bio selectors from Shadowland. Or you can go into Dimension Missions, and if you have a lot of support tokens, you can go in here and go to Blast, and go right here, and get Sharon Rogers right here for free. All you gotta do is just spend the tokens, and it depends on how if you uh, spend a little bit of money where you can get a VIP discount. So that's why I have like over 2,000 bios of Sharon Rogers because I I went ahead and got them in the uh, Support shop, as you see, you get a little discount. If you use anybody else, it's going to be a little bit more. So, we're going to see how many it uses. So, we got 2097. I'm going to use EOD to level her up. Okay. Yeah, I'll probably have to end up getting a little bit more. Yep, I have to get a little bit more. Mm -hmm. so, so what we're gonna do is go ahead and just use the rest of them, and then use somebody's not gonna get a uniform no time soon. And that will probably be, hmm, we'll go Iron Man, alright, got level 80, alright, so, as you can see, her energy attack went up to 62,000, her HP went up to 63,000, and her physical and energy defense went up to almost 19,000, so it's like 18. 18.6 thousand so that's pretty massive jump all right so we're gonna go right back into stage 39 of ultron all right captain will will get the gold later all right we're gonna go back into ultron stage 39 same team up we're gonna see <clears throat> how much she can get down to in three minutes so the last time was 24 bars, so we're going to see how far she can get now. Wow, okay. Okay, we died on that one, cuz. Alright, that was my mistake. I should have been paying attention, but she did. She got down more than, she got, what, the 21 bars in less than 30 seconds? Wow. Okay. So, alright. Gotta pay more, uh, close attention to Ultron, cuz he does, does crazy stuff like that. So, we're gonna take a little bit of damage, accumulate. 
it. Two steel. Okay. So you gonna do all right. Now two three. Use a two steel to move around. Turn it a little bit more. Wow. Now we're we'll gonna see what we're gonna do now. A little bit more damage. Okay. Less than 50 seconds, he's down to 15 bars. Wow. Wow, that is a massive boost right there for uh, Sharon Rogers. Okay, I don't want to get hit by that. Okay, you all want to do your auto attack when he's in the optimization phase. Oh. Definitely want to dodge that. Alright. Okay, <laughs> all right. Well, we haven't even hit three minutes yet, and she's already down to 13 bars. That is crazy. And with her old uniform, she couldn't even do that, so that's pretty dope. Trust me, I've tried. I've tried to do it. Okay. And he moved out the way. So what you're gonna do. Okay. Now I'm gonna do a little run around and he's gonna optimize, so. Wish that's okay. I just want to see how far she can go over 80. And she is doing really, really, really good. Not bad, not bad. She's just a little bit faster than Black Bolt, really, on my account. But he has like a uh, Mighty Rage. Okay, go, 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 go. Oh, man. Okay, alright. That was unfortunate, and I got beat. Alright, okay, alright. He kind of stuck me in the corner right there, but she can definitely do that stage. No problem. No problem at all. Just, uh, had to go a little bit quicker with her. But like I said, her damage comes from when she takes damage. So, you, like I said, you want to do the three, then you want to cancel into the four, uh, the five. And then, as soon as she throws the spirit up, then you want to go into the four, and then the same with the tier three, and do three cancel five, slight delay four, and then tier three. So, not bad, not bad at all. She is. I like the aesthetics. In a uniform, she has a tattoo of the shield on her shoulder, as you can see. Has the whole uh, Harley Quinn Sailor Moon thing going on, which is all right. She has Poseidon, Poseidon four on her uh, leg. Not bad. I like her spear though; it's like a sword and a spear together. So that's pretty dope. And she kind of turns it into a gun, as you can see. Wow, that's that's pretty sick. I like the details in it. So 
I'm gonna do a little bit more testing with her. But uh let me know what y'all guys think of Captain America Sharon Rogers. Uh, hit me down in the comment box down below. Make sure y'all smash that like button. And uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Take care.